Chris, this, um, this run you're on now, the West Ham, Swansea and Arsenal games, you must feel put you on the, on the edge really of being safe. And I know you won't tell your players mm. that, but that's how it feels. No, probably what, what it feels at the moment. It feels like a, a, a big win today, and particularly because of who we were playing against. Um, but I think our form coming into this game allowed that to happen, particularly first half where I thought we were we were good and, and possibly might have even got another goal uh, on top of that. But um, uh, you know we've been on our on on the edge you know all season because every every game that we come into we know that we have to play at a level to get something and and. Um, we're probably hitting, you know, our best form. Well, so, sorry, we're not. We are definitely hitting our best form at the right s stage of the season, and um, it's now whether we can take that form into the next game. But although it's Arsenal today, what's more important is the three points. Early in the game, did you feel you were playing a demoralised team because they, you know, they didn't defend particularly well and they looked very unsure of themselves? Did you feel that you had a chance to exploit that? Um, yes, uh, but only because you know that's what happened. You know, in in. In a game where it can go either way, you know the sec second half's different. You know, you know you're going to be under pressure, but I thought we had good periods, really good periods of um, phases in that first half, and and it was a first half where, apart from the two that we got, I thought we might have even got another one or, or possibly even two goals. I thought we started that well, um, but that can change, and you know probably going into that last half an hour, our our fortune would have been very much, I think, on the break. Where they probably look like you know creating something a little bit more, but but I thought over 90 minutes I thought we were a better team. Did you feel as if that first 40 minutes was the most complete performance you put in this season? Um, like yes, I would have to say so. I would I would say so because because of the opposition. We, we've um, we were good against uh, Swansea here, capitalised very much in a, in a second half period. Um, away at Man Man United, we played really well and. Um, we're really unfortunate not to come away with something from that, um, but probably yes. I think because of the the level of the team and the start, I thought we started really well and and um, and created an atmosphere here at the stadium which which helped us. Can I ask you about Shalotto? Is it how's the injury and what did you think of the actual challenge? My, my, my first impression on the challenge was it it, it was a coming together. I, I didn't see anything malicious in it at the at the time. Um, I haven't seen it again, but I'm led to believe that's that that yeah that's the case. I think it's um, he was shook up at the time, and may, maybe there, there'll be a, you know a slight bit of concussion or so. But he, he certainly seemed okay in the changing room afterwards. Yes. Chris Brighton was a huge threat from set pieces today. Is that something you've been working on? Um, yes, but it's been something that we've been working on all season. So you know sometimes. Sometimes you go through a period, and we, we've gone through a long period of of conceding goals from from corners, far too many this season. Um, thankfully, with that challenge, we've very much turned around, and we've been a lot more solid from set plays. Um, but we haven't scored enough goals from corners, so uh, not just particularly this game. We've been working on it all season, and just sometimes you go through a, a period where you know you get on the end of it, and we have we have been lately. This is your first result against one of the top six. Is that a sort of psychological maybe breakthrough? Um, yes, I think so. Um, and, and I probably didn't think that before. What, what, more importantly, I mean, if you if you said to me at the start of the season that's, that we'll stay up with a certain amount of, of points, but you won't beat any of the top six, then we would have settled for that. So so probably before I didn't think that, but um, I think that will do us, I think, the world of good today. Knockout looked seen the TV pictures, I don't know whether you've seen them, but he looked upset when subbed. Is that just understandable? Understandable. I, I, I think I would, I would be exactly the same if I was him. He's, he's, he's playing well at the moment, he's doing a good job for, for the team and I think I would feel the exact the same way. But um, but he's, uh, he's a professional player and he's uh, he's been great for us and uh, he will con continue to be good for us. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Depends what I suppose what the threshold is on on sprints. I, I suppose. Um, it, it's what what we demand from from we 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 are not not the level of team that can that can afford to have a you know a striker that wants to stay up front and just wait for opportunities. We we have to have strikers that are prepared to work. 
and and that's what he does, Glenn. And the fact that he works it, it allows him to get into to good areas to have to have opportunities. But he's a but he's a player in in really good form at the moment, and um, uh, and you know he's the one that should get the credit for that. Everybody said you had this difficult last month of the season coming up, Chris. It must be nice to have you know thirty four points on the board before you before you get into those last five. Mm -hmm. Well, it, it's 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 always more comforting. So it, it, so even coming into this game, it's always more comforting when you are on, on the back of, of a win because it, it um, alleviates a little bit more pressure. Um, I think that you that you've had the win. Most people probably still didn't expect us to, to win today. So going into this type of game, it's I wouldn't say it's a bonus, but it just relieves that maybe just that little bit of pressure on on having to get a result and. Uh, and it's a nice position to be in, and um, certainly there, there will be an, an element, a very small element of that, which will hopefully create uh, some confidence. Um, but I think at the moment, these, this, this group are working that hard. Um, they're giving themselves every chance. Uh, very, uh, very comforting. Um, but we, we are, we're all professionals around here, and um, come, we're in tomorrow. So come tomorrow, it, it has to be very much on the next game. And can we, can we get some more points that will make it even more comforting? So um, the thing about this game is, as soon as you start taking your foot off the pedal and start thinking that you're a better team than you are, there are too many good teams around that can that can knock you off that.